They were not. They tell me that they heard yelling at the Sterling Drive home all the time, and they say they really were tempted to do something to intervene, but we just learned from police that they have no record of any domestic disturbance calls to that address. Neighbors saying it is their number one regret that they never called 911 to intervene. A family living the American dream in the Gwinnett suburbs. Just got married about, um, see the baby's 14 months, so they got married about 24 months ago. It's a lovely neighborhood. We never have this kind of thing going on. It, it was absolutely shocking. It looks picture perfect, but next door neighbor Shirley Connell says it sounded different. A lot of yelling dog barking. A nightmare situation unfolding behind closed doors. The call originally came in from a family member who was requesting a welfare check because there were a few family members inside the house who were not answering their phone. If they looked inside the house and that's when they could see at least one person inside who is not moving. A married couple dead in what Gwinnett County Police are labeling a murder suicide. It's just one of those situations where you just don't know what to do. The only survivor, a 14-month-old boy. The baby is fine. Um, we just talked to the grandmother, and she's taken the baby. I just heard back from the medical examiner, and she says she's not going to be able to do examinations to determine the causes of death until tomorrow. And she says since she's not sure if next of kin has been notified, she's not able to release the identities. For now, reporting live in Gwinnett County, I'm Madeline Montgomery, Atlanta.